Hey guys, this is Mr. A Crazy here, and in tonight's movie review, I'm going to be doing a movie review on the Netflix movie that came out in 2020, and that's going to be on The Trial of the Chicago 7. The Trial of the Chicago 7 is directed by Aaron Sorkin, and the story of, of The Trial of the Chicago 7 goes like this. <clears throat> The film is based on the infamous 1969 trial of, of seven dead defendants charged by the federal government with, with con conspiracy and more, ar arising from, from, from the, from the countercultural protests in Chicago at, at the 1968 Democrat, Democratic Net National Convention. The trial tra transfixed the, the nation and, and sparked a, a conversation about, about mayhem intended to, to undermine the, the, the U.S. government. And there you go. So, I, like, recently, not too long ago, I actually watched this movie on Netflix. Like, I kind of felt like watching it on Netflix since I, since I, since I, I've been hearing pretty good things about, I've been, he I've been hearing a lot, lots of praise for, for this movie, calling it, like, almost calling it, like, calling it, like, one of the best films of 2020. And I, I think this movie was also, an, it also got an Oscar nomination for, for best, for best picture of 2020. And and of course, like like every like 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 every twenty twenty release, like, like this movie was supposed to be released in theaters, and until Netflix bought the rights to this movie, and so it's streaming on Netflix only. But but like I said, not too long ago, I watched the whole thing on Netflix along, along with Judas and the Black Messiah, and and I got this, and, and of course I already reviewed Judas and the Black Messiah, and and as for this movie, The Trial of the Chicago Seven, it's actually it's at. I think it's actually a very interesting movie, and I actually thought this movie was actually really great, and, and it's also very interesting, too, because because this movie's actually based on true events, and it's actually based on a true story. And I gotta say, like, Aaron Sorkin, I gotta say, Aaron Sorkin does a good job directing this film, and and the cast members, the acting the acting itself is very good, too. It's got, like, you know, talented actors, like, like Sasha Baron Cohen, Jeremy Strong, Eddie Redmayne, Michael Keaton, Joseph Gordon-Levitt, and... Oh yeah, and of course, like there's also this one actor I know, like Yo y Yaya Abdul Mateen the second. Like, because most of the time I have trouble pronouncing actors' names right. Because like, he he's basically the actor from Aquaman, and he was he was also in the in the Candyman movie from from last year, and and he was recently in, in the Michael Bay film Ambulance. Yeah. <clears throat> <coughs> Excuse me. And I gotta say, the music score was actually very well done too. Like like Daniel Pemberton, I, I I've heard I've heard of him before. And and of course, not not only Netflix distributed this movie, but but also but also like Paramount Pictures Studios, but not really, but 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 DreamWorks Pictures also made this film too. DreamWorks made this film, and and I gotta say that this this, is, this movie was actually very interesting. Like like how like it's, like it's got talented acting performances, and it's got like you know. That it that it that it's based on true events, like I said, and and I enjoyed everything about the trial of the Chicago Seven. I actually thought it's a very well done movie, and probably probably one of the best films of twenty twenty, in my opinion. In terms of horror films that came out in twenty twenty, I also enjoyed Come Play as well. Like if if you haven't heard of Come Play, and if you're and if you're a scary movie fan like me, then I recommend checking out Come Play as well. Yeah, I also recommend Trial of the Chicago 7 as well. So overall, The Trial of the Chicago 7 is, is a very well done movie from 2020. And I'm and I'm going to give The Trial of the Chicago 7 4 out of 5 stars. Yeah, I highly recommend it for sure. So there you have it guys. That's going to be it for my movie review on The Trial of the Chicago 7. And that's going to be it for this video. So make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. And as always, thanks for watching, and until next time, this is Mr. A. Crizzy saying goodbye everybody and that's about it.